In just the last hour, we got a new picture of the car that police believe hit a 77-year-old woman and then took off. And at last check, by the way, she was in critical condition. That crash happened right by City Hall. The Now's Jordan Burgess is live with a look at the search for the driver who hit her. Jordan. Right now, police say they believe that woman was crossing Central Avenue over in this area, right by City Hall. They don't say think she was in the crosswalk. She'd almost gotten across, but they believe she didn't see the car coming. It hit her, and then the person took off without helping her, but not before they were caught on camera. He stood to stop. A look at the car the police believe hit 77 year old Irene Swain as she was crossing the street. They say it appears to be a four door Hyundai Sonata with no front license plate. They tell us the driver actually circled the block after the crash, but then rather than go to where Swain was hit, they went the wrong way down Central Avenue. He should have checked on her. He should have been up here running. Swain lives in the Gateway Plaza apartments just feet from where she was hit. Those who see her say she often likes early evening walks. She's an older lady that really just stays to herself and walks around the building at nighttime. I guess she doesn't sleep well at night. Those who live in the area of Central Avenue, like Michelle Cunningham, say it doesn't seem like the street is a major danger. I have not come close to being hit. You just got to be careful around traffic time. But other than that, there's no problems down here. But police say it's important no matter where you are to use the crosswalks. When they want to cross the street and there is a crosswalk available, you need to be in that crosswalk. That's the safest place for you to be. That's where the drivers usually expect pedestrians to be. And if you're not in that crosswalk, you can be a surprise to the motorist. And then that's when we have the accidents. Now, last check, Swain's still in critical condition, but police hopeful that she'll survive. And they say if you know anything about that car or who was driving it, to call them or Crime Stoppers. Reporting live, Jordan Burgess, 9 on your side.